This month on Every Third Thursday, we're harnessing the power of the sun and building a solar snowboard. This is Every Third Thursday, a chance for us to have some fun in our factory, get creative with board design and materials, just get spontaneous, come up with a theme, and build it. Joey, solar, power film. We came across this power film, which is super lightweight, flexible, waterproof, it's even perfect for the snowboard. Look at that, it's like a piece of paper. This is going to be the best option. We got this stuff from Powerfilm. Really, really thin, flexible material that will take uh, sunlight, convert it into uh, power, store it in this battery right here, and then we can charge iPads, cell phones. Seeing how this every third Thursday we're doing the solar powered board, we decided to go with a huge sun on the base. So along with the black base, we're going to use yellow on the inside and orange on the outside along with the signal logo. So many little pieces. And we get to put all the little pieces back together. It's like a big puzzle. I trust that we don't need this one in orange. So me and Scott are getting our top sheet or our solar panels ready to get laid up. To make sure we don't damage any of these cells and we have room for our inserts in the center of the board, we're going to cut this guy right down the middle and then we'll be able to spread it out to the tips and then you can put a little bit of material uh, right in the center to put the inserts into. I wish I was a little stranger. What's cool about this is Scott, he's a snowboarder and an electrician, and we're melding, for him, two of his passions into one right now. I've never seen it before, so it's, it's going to be cool. Looks good. Oh man, look at that base. Yeah, it looks pretty awesome. amazing. Time to wire it up. All we have to do here is solder these to the terminals on the solar panel, and then we're going to run our little uh, inverter off of that. And so now we're going to mount the mounts for the little inverter. We put two inserts in the center. We're going to mount these clamps and set it in there. This little inverter has two rechargeable batteries, and then you can charge pretty much anything you need. Now we're ready for the sunlight. Well, there you go. As soon as it hit the sun, the red light turned on. So that means it's charging. My phone's now charging from my snowboard. Now we're off to Mammoth. We're here at Mammoth. We got our solar board. It's already starting to charge. You can see the LED light there charging up. Let's go ride this thing. I think the thing that hits me the most is we actually get to go ride it. Like, you'd normally like you'd build like a solar panel idea and you just stick it in your backyard and that'd be it. It would collect energy and you'd use it for something, but we're gonna go shred this thing. We have Tyler Flanagan riding the solar board. He's a local at Mammoth, total ripper. The whole day you're just charging, you're not only charging the jump, you're like charging your electronics. Feels good. Tyler's killing it on this board. The sun just came out. Charge me up. <laughs> I can't believe my phone's charging from a snowboard. <laughs> 
Everybody was excited about the solar board. So everyone was asking about it, wanted to check it out. Solar board crushing it. The greatest thing about this solar board is you don't even notice that it's a solar board. It feels like any other board. I thought it was going to be super stiff. It's not. It's actually super nice. brought this board in from the sun and we're going to plug as many things as we can into it right now. We've got our contour, our point and shoot, the GoPro, and our battery pack for the Canon DSLR. And the iPhone 5, all of them charging. We've got a few photographer buddies that can use this board. And then the other cool thing we thought about is when your board's done, like after you've worn it out, you just throw it in your backyard or you take it with you on trips and just use it as power. Woo! -hoo! 